welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2, everybody. Uh, today we're helping Uncle. You know. Home Improvement. I love that show. Damn good show. Uh, we'll talk to Uncle. This, uh, this shit shack ain't gonna be fun. Ah, feels like old times. <laughs> it's good to have the old gang back together again. Let's just hope things don't turn out like last time. Here he goes. What'd I tell you, Charles? Boy is as sour as weak old milk. No wonder she didn't stay with you. Not even a retired two dollar whore would stay with you. That's the goddamn truth. Now you used to be decent company, but now you're worse than a snake with a toothache. All he does is whine, whine, whine. Excuse me. Oh, don't get all angry. It ain't gonna change nothing. You're hopeless. And I mean that literally. You got no hope. I mean, look at you. Look at this place. Your dream home. I've had better nightmares than this dream. Oh, darling Abigail, I've changed. Come live with me in an outhouse. I wouldn't ask my worst enemy to take a shit in. What are you trying to say? It's awful. It's a dump. The house has got to go. Get some self-respect, you miserable sack of shit. Build a house so the lady set foot in. The place just needs a woman's touch. It needs leveling. No woman would touch this place. Now, I reckon these horses can have it down in a minute. Here, come on. Tie that end around the horses. You loop that end around there. Horses will pull it clean down. <laughs> we good? I think so. All right. Well, <laughs> let's get going. Now, just pull. You got this, John? I love how... We'll go when you do. Oh, okay, okay. I love how it takes Uncle to roast the crap out of John to get him to do this because he doesn't realize this is bad. See? I told you it wouldn't be no trouble. And now? Now we head into town, buy ourselves a house right out of a book. Same as if it were a bicycle. Where in town? There's a fellow by the train store. Cakes hardwood and timber. Okay, you keep working here. But if I don't go with you, who's gonna Just tell you that? Just need a bit of peace and quiet from your incessant yapping. Charles, make him work. Whip him if you have to. Oh man. Yeah, these missions are really short, so I'm just like doing two or three of these at once. Complete within 18 seconds. Wow. Oops, I didn't mean to go there. Map, okay, I need, yeah. So we gotta go talk to Sadie. Okay, I'm gonna stop here because I was told there's something I can get here. I don't know what. How about that, I think I might fella? cut the Sadie thing out if you see this where you're from. I'm like, oh, he chose not to cut. <clears throat> yeah. I thought that mission was longer because I thought from there I went and we went and got a place. And then we started the mission farming simulator. You now, you piece of shit. I want his kill. He really tried it. He shall die. What is That's gonna be hard to deal with when I get my Schofield. Uh, you know, in 
Red Dead Redemption, you don't get the Skullfield Revolver in a good proportion in. You don't get it until about the time you go to Mexico. Which kind of sucks, but I guess it makes sense. <laughs> yeah, see, I have one. Yeah, I got uh Huh. Okay, well if anyone wants to read this, they can pause and read it. I have a bounty. Gotta be done. I don't know what I'm, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't have a bounty. I'm 20 bucks, and nobody cares about 20 bucks. Ready, boy? Alright, so I can go talk to the mayor if I want. Do you guys have an arms dealer I can go to? No. Morning, Parker. Alright. Yeah, I feel like each town would have, I guess, this was actually. Based off of each town would have a gunsmith. Only causes me trouble. No fool. Unless I go to a truly poor town. What's the matter with you? My horse doesn't want to hitch. I'm trying to hitch my horse on here. Oh, my horse. There we go. Just leave me be. Dude, you took me jump. serious, didn't you? Getting all red in the face. Sadie. Oh, John! <laughs> Come sit down. Sure. You uh, got any work? Yeah. Well, there's always work. Whole country's getting robbed, robbing or stopping robbers. Well, seems like there ain't much else in this world except bastards, victims of bastards, and the bastards who want to put the bastards in the ground. And which are you exactly? Me? In my time, all three. Same as most people. I guess. Funny thing about this job, well, opportunity, I just might get to be all three again. How you mean? <clears throat> you ever heard of uh, Shane Finley? Cattle wrestler? Murder, thief, child killer. He's wanted in five states. I caught him last week. He was disguised as a lady in a house for fallen women. <laughs> I was bringing him in, and I got robbed by a professional rival of mine, James Langton. Oh, he's a nasty bastard. I didn't much like him even before he robbed me. That happened a lot. This line of work. Yeah, but they're all people like me. Anyway, now they're holed up in the desert down south waiting to head north so they can hand them in to the state troopers in the north country. I'd given up on the job as just a... Bad lot, but now that you're here, maybe we can go rob him back. Is the money good? Yeah, it's real good. Plus, I don't much like getting robbed by no one. Come on. Where is it we're heading again, you say? Mm. South. Now come on, mount up. We got a ride ahead of us. Of course we do. I wonder if it's possible to use Sadie's gun. Uh, yeah, in case anybody hasn't noticed, I, I got a headphones that I can mute now. So, you know, throughout the Let's so yeah, that's something. I have so ah. many guns. Yes, ma'am. Always have a pump shotgun, like me, just in case I get a little. That new horse? Some folk buy ranches, some buy horses. Horses are cheaper. He looks mean. He is. Behemoth of a horse. A ranch? It's ranch. something else, you know. You gotta come up there. Ain't had any Starting trouble. Out. 
some squatters, but that's it for the most part. That's good. Maybe these fellers I heard about have stayed north or gone off somewhere else or dropped down dead in their own tracks. It's good country. All country is good. Care, a couple of them. It's just folk that are bad. You know who I got up there with me? Uncle. Besides Uncle. Abigail? Uh, Abigail ain't come there just yet. Really? You, er, want to talk about it? Well, maybe, but Charles Smith. We found Charles Smith. Charles? He's alive? Yeah. He's doing okay. He was prize fighting in Saint Denis. Weren't seeming too well. He took everything real hard. But I think life on the plains is gonna be good for him. I always liked Charles. You send him my best. I will. You know you can come along too. Build a cabin on the land. I've done that all before. Can't do it again. <laughs> I'm on my own now, John. I, I ain't so good with people. Uh, the offer's there, whenever you want it. That's kind. Unlikely to be taken up, but kind. You heard anything you know, I think of you can't. Nothing. You? Damn it, no. John, let me talk. You'd think. He's a colorful character. Word would get out. That's one way of putting it. Look, what happened with the gang changed everyone who was a part of it. The Dutch who put a blanket round me after the O'Driscolls, that weren't the same man at Beaver Hollow. And now, he might not be so colorful no more. You see a man whose character changed. I see a man who got found out for who he truly was. We was fools to follow him. I was a fool and I paid for it. Are we already at St. Denis? Oh, no. Okay. I was one of the lucky We're actually ones. Actually, he's landing. Micah, John. Micah's the one who set it off. I blame me for following Dutch for too long, but I blame Micah for most everything else. He's out there. And someday, I hope we'll find him. But uh, not now. Come on. Yeah, there was a. Uh... I was gonna say, it would be funny if you see Sadie bunk at John's house every so often. He's like, hey John, I need a place to stay. They just don't want us to pass <laughs> McFarland. That's crazy. James Langton, the bounty hunter, has got this outlaw you captured in a women's boarding house? Shane Finley, correct. And we aim to have Langton give him back to us before he rides north with him to hand him over to some state troopers? Correct again. Though the giving back part is optimistic. I'm forever the optimist. the game and he spent almost the entire game here in the first one this is the place it's a view all right oh no it looks like Ari kind of how people think Let's Arizona look looks I'm not fully sure how Arizona looks but yeah correct me if I'm wrong that looks like part of like it's based off of Arizona. Be quicker if we both here. You got binoculars. Don't you? Anything? Not yet. Keep looking between here and that town. They'll be there. 
homeward. I think I see something. Yup. There they are. Down there. Who's who? Great. Well, the bounty is a feller who's all tied up. <laughs> Very funny. And that big fat feller with the funny hat? That's James Langton. The other fellas just work for him. Where do you think they're heading? Well, come on. Let's go follow them. Oh, I gotta tell you where they're going because I can't see. We've got to follow them, John. Come on. Hey, I'm trying to yeah. find out where they're going, Sadie. They'll be coming through here. Hmm, that's why I can find them. Isn't this a gang of hideout location? Location? There they are. We follow and keep an eye on them. Yeah, this is a gang location either in the first game or know they're down also. there. Don't ride so close. You won't get north through here. What are you doing, huh? You, you talking to me or like to Sorry, I ain't used to having anyone with me. <laughs> My guess is they'll stop up ahead. We can get a better look at them. You know his thinking pretty well. Hmm? If you can't outgun them, you gotta outthink them. Yeah. The canyon opens up down a ways. We'll head them off there. I don't know. I think I'll look at like some pictures of Arizona that people were in. So I can go from there and talk more about it tomorrow. I like that scenery to the left of like kind of like Arizona. Up here, get off your horse. This might be our chance. <clears throat> yeah, they're stopping. And that's sure. Oh yeah, this is a location. That's coming off the back of his horse. What are they waiting for? Uh, the rest of Langton's men, I think. <laughs> Langton's doing pretty well for himself. How come he's got all them men? And you work alone. Right <laughs> I got you. You're worth ten of them. <sighs> Great. All right, so what you think? Should we threaten them? Start shooting at them or sneak down and pick them off one by one? I reckon sneaking down is our best opportunity, but uh, it's your call. Yeah, let's sneak. I'll follow your lead. Let's sneak down there. Okay, well, follow away. Stay down and stay close. Let's go. It's gonna be fun. I want more options. Like, I, let me pick if I want to sneak or if I want to go cave. loud. Look out on these rocky paths. I got a bow, but I do got throwing knives and tomahawks and a knife. A couple of knives. Yeah. Machete. Any game I can use a machete, that's gonna be like one of my favorite weapons to use. Yes, look. Quarky. Okay, let's move. Up ahead, a 
another one on patrol. How about this guy? And so the reason that's going to be yellow is if I do not pick it up, I cannot keep the gun. Or I can't keep the weapon. I, I will not be able to find it again. Gonna hear us on these bridges, but it's worth a try. See, that I hate. Like, I threw it and it doesn't hit him. You know, I figured, hey, let's try to throw a throwing knife. But... to shoot the guy Robin May, LinkedIn. 
I got something good on him. Come on, it's time to collect. Let's okay, you're you taking Phil. Let's go. Get him on your horse. Untie me. Are you with her? What's it look like? Let's go. Let's go. Get on there. I'm gonna borrow your hat, friend. You should let me alone. I got a feeling this time will be different, hey, Finley. Help! What At least get out of here. Come on! I need to relieve myself. There'll be a bucket in your cell. I'm serious. Yep, and so am I. Hit him, John, please. <laughs> hey, you don't need to do that just because she told you to. I don't need to be hit. I just want to be treated civil. Shut it. You heard the lady. Thank you. I still protect hey, my innocence. Yeah. This woman ripped me out of my bed, kidnapped me, then let Langton kidnap me, then you killed them all and kidnapped me back. I'm the victim here. Damn you. John, would you be so kind as to shut him up? Don't listen to her. Now, let me speak my piece. There's no call to hit me, mister. Listen to him squirm. Jesus. Bad dog. <laughs> That's it. How did work ain't easy, John? No, but I can see now it has its rewards. Well, it's a whole lot easier with a partner. That back there? You didn't need a partner. You needed a whole company behind you. We did fine. And with Langton and his men gone, there'll be more demand for our service. <laughs> Sadie? Yeah. You know I'm a yeah, rancher Sadie. now. <laughs> Mostly. And I know how you're paying for your ranch. Don't spread that around. Hi, I won't. But it would be good to have you along some more. Yeah, we'll see. Maybe. We don't talk about the fact that Sadie died. Oh, here we are. Grab him and bring him in, John. Sure. You're a bitch and a bastard. We brought in Shane Finley. Oh, great. Let's, uh... Put him in the cell. Uh, 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 
yourself. I hate you. We're gonna watch you swing. What for? I didn't do anything. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. I thought you said you lost him. Well, I did, but we got him back. Oh, and James Langton's dead. We killed him. Why'd you do a thing like that? It was him that robbed me. Okay. Here. There's a decent price on Finley. Mm-hmm. I know. <laughs> you want this money to go to the bank, too? No, I'll, uh, I'll take it myself. <laughs> okay, Jim Milton. It's John Marston here. All right, well, if you need any more work, you can find me in town. Or maybe I'll find you. I'm retired. Sure. <laughs> Be well, John. Bucks. If I remember correctly, it's like a few days after this game, or not a few game days, but a few weeks after this game ends. John has to work for the government or something. I know it takes place in 1911, and that's the first red. Nineteen eleven or nineteen oh seven? I think it might be nineteen oh seven. Or nineteen oh nine. It's somewhere in that area. I'll have to look at it again. But uh, yeah. You guys enjoyed the video, you know? Why not drop a like, subscribe, hit that bell, and uh I'm out.